this is Steven, and today I am playing an old game from a long time ago. Well, probably a long time ago for, you know, compared to now, but this is like, I played this game when I was a kid. Loved the heck out of it. It is called Marble Drop, and it was published by Maxis of, uh, you know, SimCity, The Sims fame, but no, my favorite one of my favorites, at least, was Marble Drop. So in this game, you have to solve uh, different puzzles with uh, dropping marbles into the slot, into the different uh, uh, funnels. So I'm going to take like a red one, and I'm going to put it here, and you can see what happens. There it goes. That. Okay, so this is going to be incorrect because now it's going to go into the yellow and that's not good okay good that's gone so now I have to be a little bit more careful um, planning which uh, which marbles are going to go where so if I put it here I have to follow this carefully it's going to go woo -woo 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 into this is going to go into red this time so I'm going to go ahead and do that there we go and now if I put if I put one here it's going to end up going into yellow so I'm going to go ahead and drop the yellow into that one. Meanwhile, I'm going to follow this one again, and it's going to go into red. And now this one... This one will end up going into... Alright. I'm not sure if you can hear all that stuff. It, it's... I'm running this in a virtual machine, so some of the sounds are going to be very, uh, maybe not as perfect as they once were. If I put it in this container, it's going to go into blue, so I'm going to go blue right there. And now, if I do it again, though, it should also go into blue. Because of this thing is open. Excellent. Alright, so now I still need another three yellows. So I'm going to send that on its way. And this will be blue. If I'm looking at it properly, this should be blue, yes. I have to be careful because um, they can't interfere with each other. Like if like if one ro rolls over and flips a, a a switch that was expecting another ball to go through, that could totally re you know switch direction. Ah, <sighs> what am I trying to say? I'm trying to say that's going to switch the outcome. Words are hard, man. All right. Uh, let's see. If I go into the left, it will end up going to red. That is where I want it to go. And if I do the right, the right one is going to end up going into yellow. I'm going to put another yellow into there because I do need another yellow. Now I need another red. Now I need a, one more blue to finish it all off. And I think this is going to be it. I still need another yellow. Oh, I I miscalculated somewhere. So where? How am I going to get? How am I going to get into the yellow? I'm going to have to sacrifice. No matter which one I do, it's going to end up getting 
buzzsawed. So I need to... Sacrifice one. And then... And now, how do I get it in there? No! Oh, gosh, why did I do that? Wait, no, I have to... I'm doing it okay. Now, either one I do now... I think I didn't need to do one of those. Alright, it's okay. It's okay. It's alright. It's okay. I'm going to do this. This should this should solve it. This should solve it. <sighs> Sometimes you have to really think about your consequences. There it goes. Uh. <laughs> oh, so if I run out of a color... I would have to purchase more of that color. Oh, ho, ho, ho. so that's even more reasons to be careful with just random, like, you have to be very careful that you're not burning your marbles more than you need to because you have to pay for those. All right, let's go into the next puzzle. Aha. This is an interesting one. This one should be a little bit easier for me to visualize, at least. Because, um... You can see how there's only one switch here. And then it hits a bumper. Or, it can if the bumper's up, then it'll just go through. So it really depends on whether or not the bumpers are enabled or disabled. Sometimes, though, the best way to f learn is to just do. Just do and see what happens. Alright, and that's gonna... The bumper is up. Now, the question I have is, is the bumper permanently up, or is it going to go back down after I'm done? So, here, I can put a yellow right there and now if I put a yellow if I put a yellow here it should go into the right yellow slot All right, so it was a one-time bumper. All right, that is um, interesting. So now... So now what do I do? If I put one here, it's going to end up going to the purple. There it goes. Okay, that, that that should be fairly easy, huh? One, two, three. If I push six, is it just going to instantly give me... No, it won't. Wait, did something happen? What happened? I wasn't paying attention. Did it get vaporized or something? 
Why'd I do that? That's the wrong area. Oh. That's what happened. I put it in the wrong ball slot. Funnel. Sometimes it's hard to find out the right word for funnel. 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 Okay, see, I, I'm not stupid. I know which funnel I was supposed to put it in, but I didn't. I didn't put it in the right funnel twice. That's great. Great job, me. Oh, you know what? I shouldn't have done this. I shouldn't have filled up all my purples because I still have to... I still have to put in my greens. And so now... I'm going to end up wasting balls. Oh no! Oh no! How silly! Oh! Oh boy! I feel so dumb. I wasted some balls because I was too much in a hurry to fill up my purples. Well, boy howdy, I have learned things now. However, it should be easy now because now I just gotta put the two yellows into that funnel and we'll be done with this puzzle. Ah! There we go. Alright, next puzzle. I'm probably going to need to buy some uh, orbs soon. I keep calling them orbs. They're marbles. Marbles are orbs, though. Are they not? Can you, can you call a marble not an orb? I don't think you can. This is a much, much more interesting looking contraption, huh? So for starters, I can see that this will cycle between going into purple and green. So this cycles between purple and green. Oh no! The first time the first time something bumps into this is going to redirect it. It's going to redirect it into... An endless cycle? I think that's what I'm seeing. That's going to go up there. It's going to basically get caught in an endless cycle. All right, let us um, let's avoid the endless cycle, shall we? Or, or we can use that to our benefit to make sure that the first the first thing that we put in is not here because that'll get caught in the in the cycle. But, after we get rid of the bumper, then it'll go into green. So, let's bump it from this side first. How will we do that? Is that even a possible thing? I don't think so. Hmm. Hmm, very interesting. Very interesting. All right, let's start over here. The first one that we do is going to be simple. It's going to be orange. So I'm going to drop in that orange. The next one is going to be green. So I'm just going to drop that into the green machine. And now this is going to be the... This one's going to be the one that's just infinite, infinite void. Yep. All right. Um, so 
So now it's back to orange. However, I should probably I should probably do this one. I'm pretty sure this is just going to be another infinite void one. But I need it. I need it for my purple. And now... Now I need this one for orange. And now... This one should be green. Followed by purple. So that is the first three levels of Marble Drop. I am going to try to figure out how to improve the frame rate, and uh, who knows, maybe I'll come back and play some more. Anyway, for now, thank you for watching.